And after those shootings, local authorities, they are taking every, every threat seriously. And that's why they charged a man they say called in a threat to a Gibsonton Walmart. ABC Action News reporter Lauren Mazzella is live now with how he, react, how he reacted when deputies took him into custody. Good morning, Lauren. A good morning, and we have just learned, Dia, that he is in custody on a temporary mental health hold. Deputies tell us that a call came in here to this Walmart in Gibsonton on Sunday. The person on the other end of the line threatened to shoot up the store. Now, we are choosing not to show that man's face or say his name. However, investigators did take a 31-year-old man into custody. His mother works here at the store. Under questioning, investigators tell us that the man did not appear to show any remorse. No, I wouldn't say that he thought it was funny, uh, but he didn't appear to be remorseful for any reason. No, he didn't deny it, just said that he didn't make the threat. So I guess in essence he denied it. But. Deputies went to work dispelling the immediate threat and working to find out who was on the other end of the call. Investigators say they did not find any firearms at his residence.